Lisa Williamson, National President for the American Legion Auxiliary. Welcome to the American Legion Auxiliary's virtual National Poppy Day program. The poppy is a remembrance flower that represents the sacrifices made for our freedoms. On the Friday before Memorial Day and throughout the year, American Legion family members distribute great paper flowers in exchange for donations. These donations go directly to our veterans and local communities. In this program, we hope to inspire you to get involved in National Poppy Day. Please enjoy the program. The poppy has been part of the American Legion family since the early 1920s. The red flowers bloomed following deadly battles in Europe during World War I. Because of this, the poppy became known as a symbol of the sacrifices made in service to our country. In 1918, Moena Michael, who later became known as the Poppy Lady, read In Flanders Fields by Canadian Lieutenant Colonel John McRae, and she vowed to always wear a red poppy as a sign of remembrance. Moena urged groups to adopt a poppy and to honor and support veterans. She was joined in these efforts by others in Europe, Canada, and Australia. In Flanders' fields, the poppies blow, between the crosses, row on row, that mark our place. And in the sky, the larks, still bravely singing, fly, scarce heard amid the guns below. We are the dead. Short days ago, we lived, felt dawn, saw sunset glow, loved and were loved, and now we lie in Flanders' fields. Take up our quarrel with the foe. To you from failing hands we throw. The torch be yours to hold it high. If ye break faith with us who die, we shall not sleep, though poppies grow in Flanders' fields. In 2017, Congress designated the Friday before Memorial Day as National Poppy Day. On this day and throughout the year, members of the American Legion family distribute poppies. Donations received from poppy distributions support veterans, active duty military personnel, and their families with medical and financial needs. For decades, American Legion Auxiliary Units have sponsored the National Poppy Poster Contest in local schools. Kids in grades 2-12 through 12 are eligible to participate. Every year, amazing artwork is submitted by talented students. Throughout this program, we will be highlighting previous Poppy Poster winners. Look inside an ALA member's closet and chances are you'll find some poppy accessories or poppy related clothing items. ALA members can show off their love for the poppy with a new bag. Our Riveter, an American handbag and accessory company, is selling a special edition hopper bag inspired by the resilient poppies of Flanders Field. Its unique design ensures you stand out by honoring those who gave everything for us. Our Riveter was co-founded by military spouses Cameron Cruz and Lisa Bradley. The company is based in North Carolina and employs military spouses who make the handcrafted handbags the company sells. When you shop using the QR code on the screen, 15% of the purchase price will be donated back to the auxiliary to support the programs of the ALA. As we remember those who sacrificed for our freedoms on National Poppy Day and Memorial Day, 
also remember veterans who may be struggling. The American Legion family encourages you to be a part of the Be The One mission to end veteran suicide. We ask you to be the one to ask veterans in your lives how they're doing. Listen when a veteran needs to talk and reach out when you think a veteran might be struggling. You can learn more about this mission at BeTheOne.org. We hope everyone has been enjoying successful poppy distributions or have had many poppy distributions throughout the year that have generated poppy funds for your unit. One obstacle many experience is how to use poppy funds. The good news is that there are several different ways that you may use poppy funds to benefit veterans, service members, and their families. Let's start with the five criteria set forth by the American Legion. The first is for the rehabilitation of veterans honorably discharged from the United States Armed Forces after April 6, 1917. The second use is for the welfare of the families of veterans of the above named period. Third is for the rehabilitation of hospitalized military service personnel returning home and awaiting discharge who require treatment in service hospitals. Fourth is for the welfare of veterans active military personnel, and the families of veterans and active military personnel of the above-named period where financial and medical need is evident. Finally, poppy funds may be used for the purpose of poppy kits and supplies used to make symbolic poppies and poppy items that will be distributed for donations to the poppy fund. Now what does that mean to the members, units, and departments? That can mean essentials for a service member and their family, such as food, gas, diapers, and other baby needs, as well as cleaning supplies. One of the ways this issue has been tackled at the national level is by creating a Memorandum of Understanding with Armed Services YMCA to allow direct donation of poppy funds to their food pantries around the country, co-located with areas of large military populations, such as Fort Hood and Fort Bragg. Another memorandum of understanding has been created with Honor Flight Network to enable poppy funds to be donated directly to Honor Flights and may be used to provide medical necessities and caregiver support to the veterans participating in the program. To donate your poppy funds or for more information, please visit the website on the screen. Last but not least is our National Veteran Creative Arts Festival Fund. Units and departments may send in their poppy funds to ALA National Headquarters earmarked for use in our support of the National Veteran Creative Arts Festival. Regardless of the approved method your unit or department decides is best, please know that your donation will change the lives of veterans, service members, and their families for the best. If you have any questions, please email poppy at alaforveterans.org. Thank you for your dedication to our mission. We're so glad you joined us for this virtual National Poppy Day. We hope you're inspired and you learn things about the American Legion Family National Poppy Day and the ALA's mission of serving veterans, military, and their families. To our American Legion family members, best of luck in your poppy events. We value your dedication and service. On this Memorial Day weekend, please take time to pause and reflect on the service members who made the ultimate sacrifice for our freedoms. And remember to wear a poppy with pride. Thank you.